Hi guys, welcome back to the 411 Mamas. It's Nicole here and my video for this week is going to be what's in my travel makeup bag or what's in my travel bag. Um, this week's videos are themed around fun and random things and I was actually trying to record this video when I was on vacation. I just got back, we just got back early early this morning and I was trying to upload it from my phone and it just didn't come out the way that I had planned so now that I'm home I figured I might as well um, you know still do this video for you all and um, you know without prolonging it any further um, this is my travel bag travel makeup bag this is where I carry all of my uh, makeup and beauty essentials um, aside from face products moisturizers cleaning products for my face that's in a separate toiletry bag but this is what I have for all of my my makeup and this is a Clinique brand and I actually did a video on this on my main channel uh, last year when we went on another trip and I pretty much fit everything in here compactly I don't know if you guys are <laughs> like like to do this as well but I'm I'm pretty meticulous about um, I just don't want to throw a bunch of all my things in there because it's like hard for me. It's like disorganized and it's hard for, harder for me to find things. So I always like to keep things inside other bags inside the big bag. I don't know. Maybe I'm just weird. But <laughs> the first thing I have here is this bag of all my brushes. I have my e.l.f. eyelash curler, which is only a dollar. And then I have my Sonia Kashuk tinted moisturizer. Um, and then all my brushes here, I'm not going to go through every single one, but um, some face and eye brushes. Um, they're varied in brands, Bedellium Tools, MAC, ELF, and I think that's it. Bedellium Tools, MAC, and ELF. Those are like my favorite brushes at the moment. And I did bring um, uh, one pair of false eyelashes by Miss Adoro, and this is number 66, just in case my husband and I were able to go out on a date night without the kids, um, and I have the lash glue for it, but we didn't end up having any date nights outside um, without the kids, unfortunately, so I didn't get to use those. Um, and the next thing I have here is my Naked Palette. I brought this last year on a trip too. I feel like this is my go-to palette for any um, trip. It has 12, is it 12? Yeah, 12 shadows here that you can make almost any kind of look, um, especially for on vacation. You know, it's just all in one. And then this was really convenient as well. Um, I recently got this on haltlook.com. Um, and it's a Too Faced brand and it has three in one uh, bronzer uh, blush and a brightener which is more like um, my highlighter for here so I love that it's so compact and I'm pretty much loving these um, color combinations for summer so this was perfect for um, the trip and then I also brought two other um, choices for bronzer and, I, and blush and this is the hot mama blush from the bomb and also a bronzer Bahama Mama bronzer from the bomb as well. So I wanted to have two other choices for um, bronzer and blush. And then this is empty now. And the last container I have here is all my little things. And this is also um, a Victoria's Secret bag from like years ago. And I did bring another um, set of shadows. And this is on the, the cheaper end from the uh, drugstore brand by Wet n Wild. And I love, love, love these shadows. Um, they're pretty similar to what I had already brought. Um, I didn't, I mean, they're still neutral colors, but I did use both. So this is my other alternative, and this is the Vanity Palette. And then I have my Sonia Kastrick Concealer Quad, but I mainly use this upper um, left color. And then uh, another thing I brought for eyes is um, Bronze Tote by L'Oreal, and it's just... If I well, I did use this actually for like a quick um, eye look without having to use brushes or shadows. And then I have my Elf eyebrow kit, which I need to replace soon. And I have an eye primer by Too, pa Too Faced, and this is their Shadow Insurance. And um, as far as eyeliners go, I can't live without my eyeliners. I 
couldn't just pick one, but I did, I actually did use all three, believe it or not. Um, this is my MAC Fluid line. It's a gel liner, black gel liner. And then this is my Urban Decay and the higher end um, eyeliner 24-7 Glide On in Perversion. And on the drugstore end, um, it's a Milani Easy Liner Retractable Pencil in black. Oops. And then for the... I wish that the Urban Decay was retractable, but it's not, so I had to bring my pencil sharpener. And then um, other things for eyes. I brought two um, Urban Decay Jumbo Stick Pencils, one in Clash, which is like a turquoise color, and the other one is called Delinquent, which is like a purple. But I didn't use this. I, I did actually use, uh oh, be careful, Emlyn. I did actually use the turquoise for my lower lash line uh, one of the days we were there. And then I also brought my Jumbo Stick Pencil in Milk, um, but I didn't end up using this, actually. So, And then the last two things in here are two, I need to get new <laughs> mascaras, but my Colossal by Maybelline, I think, and my YSL Sample Size um, sh uh, Mascara in Shocking. I guess that's what it is. So that's pretty much all that I had in this whole makeup bag. And... I do have this other little bag that I do carry in my purse, which holds all of my lip stuff and my face powder, my MAC um, Studio Fix and NC42. I keep this in here because um, it has my mirror and then I can um, touch up if I need to. Um, and then I have like a mini Nivea sample size uh, lotion. And um, these are all the lip products that I bring. And these, the ones that I brought are ones that I use pretty much every, um, every day, aside from one of them. And I have this one that I got from my My Glam bag, and it's more of a red um, color, which I didn't even use. Um, and this, what's the brand of this? Studio Gear. I didn't even use that. And then I have two lip balms. One is from Derm Store, a lip quench. And my other lip balm is Burt's Bees in fig and then my favorite all-time um lipstick l'oreal in ferris nude and also another drugstore favorite rimmel's airy fairy which i'm using today both of those actually and then i have my max um half and half which is a nude color um and then i have a, a lip butter but um in sugar plum and then i have a uh what is this l'oreal balm like similar, they're both similar um, consistencies. This is a, oops, what color is this? Like a peachy coral, caring coral. Um, but this is on more of a sheer side. And I pretty much used all of them except for the, the red one when we were on the trip. So those are the only things, those are the things that I have for my travel bag. Uh, I thought this would be a fun video to share with you guys on the Farm Woman Mamas. I was hoping to record it, like I said, when I was on vacation, but either way, um, that's pretty much it, and I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to like us on Facebook if you haven't already, and subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye!